Hello everyone and uh, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, we will guide you through the process of resolving issues with the EFL live app not working. Without further delay, uh, let's dive into the solutions. First solution is a force close and restart EFL live app. To begin, open your phone setting and navigate to the app manager. After that, uh, select the EFL app from the app list. Then I click on force stop from the bottom right corner. Confirm by clicking OK and then reopen the app. Second solution is to disable and enable your internet connection. If the issue persists, to try toggling your internet connection. If you are using mobile data, then turn it off for 5 to 10 seconds. And then switch it back on. For Wi-Fi users, turn off Wi-Fi for the same duration and then uh, switch it back on alternatively activate aeroplane mode for 4 to 5 seconds then you turn it off after that uh, check if the issue resolves third solution is uh, update AFL app and live app to the latest version to do this you uh, have to the play store and uh, search for the AFL live app then I uh, select the app if an update is available, you will see an update button next to the app. Tap on it to update the app to the latest version. Once updated, launch the app again. Fourth solution is to clear AFL live app catches. Clearing the app catches can often resolve performance issues. To clear AFL live app catches, go to your phone setting. Open App Manager and select AFL Live App from the app list. Then click on Storage and Catches and finally tap on Clear Catches to clear the app catches. Fifth solution is uninstall and reinstall the AFL Live App. If the problem persists, uninstall the AFL Live App by going to Play Store, searching for the app and selecting Uninstall. Once uh, uninstalled, uh, reinstall the app by clicking on the install button. If none of the above methods work, uh, the issue may be AFL live app server is down. In such cases, uh, you may need to wait for some time and try again later. Thank you for watching our video and we hope this solution helps resolve the AFL live app issue for you.